Okay, as promised, as promised, here's my collection of Hot Toys figures, Intebay figures, and one Medicom figure. Alright, we first start at my uh, Predator figures. On the left, you got the Guardian, in the middle, the Lost Predator, and at the right, you got the Pred 2, the normal version. Oh man, I still have to have, uh, have to do a review about that guy. Yeah, I already done this and done him. Right, these are the Preds. Down below, cut my Entebay figures. The Bruce Lee Entebay figure, Enter the Dragon version A. I already uh, bought the extra head sculpt. Only have to have an extra body, and then I can display him with the, the or the brown uh, kung fu suit, or the one with the, only the yeah uh, the hand gloves, the boxing uh, gloves. Okay, this is uh, uh, Game of Death. Great uh, diorama. I like it a lot, and I'm so glad I have this figure, man, because it's a. Uh, uh, you gotta pay the, uh, the 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 ponies for this guy, but I get it for a great deal. All right, then we got on the right Kato. This is one. Uh, this is the only figure you can uh, get everywhere all, all, almost because this is the latest uh, uh, figure that came out. So if you're still interested in this guy, check eBay or other. Uh, Collectible size. They, uh, they really, um, they have, they have them in stock, of on stock. Okay, go one low again. Got all the Dark Knight uh, collectibles. First uh, in the middle, of course. I like them a lot. Heath Ledger as the Joker, the DX version. His head sculpt is really freaking amazing. And I like the detail, really. Look at the grenades and everything, you know, his coat, his pants, boots, everything. Okay, at the back, uh, you got the, the bank robber Joker. Like him a lot also, with his mask and his uh, uh, bag with uh, grenades and everything. Real cool. And on the other side, we got Two Face. Nice. Harvey Dent. And. It's okay, this figure. I really have to uh, get some uh, extra bodies because I also want to display the Harvey Dent. And of course, the police officer. Okay, one compartment down again, and this is my only Medicom figure, Darth Maul. I really dig this figure, man. Real nice. With the force pose and his uh, lightsaber. Yeah, I, I, I definitely want to purchase uh, more Medicom figures. For instance, start uh, Fader, um, uh, just some Stormtroopers, um, yeah, Boba Fett, all the classic ones. Okay, we go up again, and the next we've got my Iron Man collection. Only got two figures this uh, of this collection. I still have to have some more, but I like this one a lot. It's one of my favorites, the Iron Man Mark III Battle Damage version. Look at the detail in this guy. Un freaking believable. I have everything uh, uh, out, the the all the gadgets, so you can see. Real cool. Okay, uh, there we got the Mark III. Uh, sorry, the Mark One version. This guy is freaking uh, detailed, unfreaking believable. 
I like this guy, man. The Mark 1. So you can see, I only missed the Mark 2. So soon I hope I can get him for a good price. I doubt that, but uh, that's the one I uh, still have to get, the Mark uh, 2. Then in this uh, Iron Man 1 series is complete. Okay, we go one compartment down. Here we got my another favorite figure, Jet Li from the movie Phyllis. I like this pose a lot. Real cool. With his ponytail and his half bolt haircut. The Shaolin haircut. Real cool. Okay, at the back we got. Uh, I think it's a little bit of a disappointed figure. <laughs> Ipman. His likeness is uh, spot on, but his body is whack. It sucks. Really sucks. Uh, I was a little bit disappointed uh, of uh, this figure because he can pose uh, uh, quite good because it's very loose. If you can see, if I put, if I want to do it like this, it comes out again. See? It's too bad. But I like the diorama he comes with. The whole plate, metal plate thing, and the wooden uh, base, or the, the wooden pole. Nice, very nice. Okay, one compartment down again. And we got uh, a statue of my Bruce Lee 70 years anniversary uh, uh, collectible. This is really a very nice uh, statue. I already pre-ordered a uh, another statue of him of the movie The Way of the Dragon. You should check it out. It's, uh, it's just uh, you can pre-order it now. If you're really a Bruce Lee fan, uh, yeah, you have to be quick because there are only 3,000 uh, worldwide giving out with also the certificate and everything. But uh, this is the first figure that uh, of, yeah that. Um, I came to uh, the Hot Toys figure. Wasn't it for, for this figure? I, I didn't know uh, Hot Toys was. Uh, <laughs> uh, I didn't know about the Hot Toys figures and the Interbay figures. So I'm glad he opened the door for me <laughs> and got me broke. Nah. <laughs> okay. And this bad guy, I just reviewed him. There you can see. Samuel Jackson, the octopus. Real nice. I like this figure a lot. And he shouldn't be here down on the on the floor. But I have to have more uh, cabinets. Okay, we go back to this amazing figure. The Pred one, guys. Really amazing. I got this for a very good deal, man. Especially uh, when I get it in, in this time. Because if you go on eBay, you gotta pay the price, man. And I was on a convention in uh, in Belgium, and I got it for a very good deal. Thanks a lot. Facts. Okay, go one down again. So you can see on the back is our blade, Wesley Snipes. Real cool figure. With a lot of accessories, a lot of weapons. Nice. Okay, in the middle, you got the Dark Knight version with the Batman custom cape. Look at the cape. <laughs> cool. And we got Arnie, the T800. In my opinion, the best head sculpt of uh, every Hot Toys figure I, uh, I've got. He's really spot on. Arnie. Okay, we go one down again. Here we go. King Leonidas 300. Unbelievable figure. This is my first Hot Toys figure. And I'm proud of it. Tonight we'll dine in hell. Real cool. Okay, we got on the back uh, Wolverine. Real cool figure as well. Like his uh, leather jeans, well, leather jeans. Uh, I like his jeans, his suede jacket, 
real cool and his blades of course and we got Hellboy amazing figure man amazing figure also spot on real nice okay on the one compartment down again we got Eldo Rain Mr. Brad Pitt also great figure very detailed comes with a lot of accessories real cool with his knife here famous knife okay on the back we got Will Turner Mr. Orlando Bloom already reviewed him uh, uh, not a long time ago and we got Prince Dashton Jack Gollum Hall Gollum Hall Gollum Hall I still pronounce his name fucked up, but here it is, Prince of Persia. Nice, nice. Okay, and here we got the bad part. The bad part. Sorry, sorry, sorry. The tumbler. I will put his lights on. Let's see. Let me see. Can't find the switch. Come on, where's the switch? Damn! <laughs> Amazing. Unfreaking believable, amazing, amazing, amazing. And oh, sorry, cabinet. And we go to the bad pot. Also with the light switch on. See, here we go. Still have to have a good place for this guy because I now I have to have next to my television. It's not a great spot, but soon it will. He will be displayed properly next to the tumbler let me switch it off and I will let you see how it looks in overall view this is it I've got two uh, 3D cabinets next to each other and all the boxes I also like to display them the boxes and I also am a diehard He-Man fan I'm also a diehard He-Man fan, if you, if you can see. <laughs> Too many figures. <laughs> and all the old school vintage Castle Grayskull, the Snake Mountain, and I don't know which what what name this, this was, but. This is and I got some Street Fighter figures still in the box, but uh, I have to have more space, man. <laughs> okay, this was my collection. I hope you enjoy watching and keep me uh, keep following me on my uh, my feeds and uh, subscribe. And uh, soon there will be another uh, review or an unboxing of a Hot Toys figure or in today, or maybe a Medicom. So thanks guys for watching and check your latest. This was Toys for Real. Peace.